Dr. Victoria, I'd like to hear your viewpoint on this in regards to technology and beauty and you know, just one thing to mention on that. We're living in such an exciting time now where we're seeing the growth of beauty tech and wellness tech. And as a medical professional, this whole area of wellness tech is super intriguing to me. Things that I'm noticing coming up now are at-home testing kits where you can test your biological age at home. There are companies that will test your longevity. And we're coming into a point where information is so accessible to the consumer and they're able to get these customized recommendations for their treatments. We're really moving away from these cookie cutter recommendations, from these cookie cutter treatments. There are also companies that are doing nutrition recommendations based on your DNA. And then when it comes to product development, I mean, a lot of this synthetic biology where they're able to do bioidentical enzymes and things like that that are not only more effective, but more sustainable too. For what I do, hydroxyapatite, you see that in a lot of these next-gen oral care companies. Hydroxyapatite is a bioidentical compound similar to things you find in bone and enamel that's based on calcium. And that was originally developed by NASA for astronauts that were losing bone in space, but now it's being used in products. So we're really seeing this massive integration of biotechnology, beauty, wellness, and I think that's just gonna move forward in a huge way.